We're gonna do a creamed spinach. We're gonna top it with these sort of country fried callettes. We're gonna actually harvest in a cold frame here a little bit for uh, a recipe for Chef Jamie. What we're doing is capturing solar energy. We just walked down to 20 degree temperatures outside and it's warm in here. There's no artificial heat. That's the beauty of this. So we put little mini tunnels over and we can even hold even more temperature. This is a low tunnel. Oh, look at that spinach. It freezes at night, it thaws during the day. The body and the color and the texture of this is just absolutely stunning. Many vegetables thrive and love the cold temperatures. Here we are in the dead of winter, and this is a kale field. Kale is not genetically modified, it's a hybrid. It's a cross between a Brussels sprout and a kale. Nice. Got some beautiful stuff out of the field. Looks like it, beautiful, great. I'm kind of excited to see what you can do with it. Okay. We're gonna do a creamed spinach. We're gonna top it with these sort of country fried callettes um, and just keep this hot and creamy and crispy and beautiful and seasonal. You know, bechamel is obviously a classic flour, butter, milk, optional stock. And we just mount it in, just slowly add. As it wilts, you keep adding till you finally get to the sort of texture and consistency you're after. Now this is not your grandmother's creamed spinach. This is in fact the best spinach in the world. One of my favorite ingredients, it's, it's uh, fennel pollen. We actually save our, our fennel blooms in the summer months. We hang them up to dry. Uh, when they're dried, we shake that off and it's just spectacular. Aromatically, it works beautiful here. While that's infusing, um, we're gonna fry our kalettes. Instead of just throwing them right into like a fryer, we bread them first. And this is just like cornmeal, flour, you know, just traditional breading procedure. They will tell you when they're done. I think it's probably gonna take, my guess is about 45 seconds. We're gonna also hit this with a little poppy seed, which is another fun texture. Wow, 